Hi, I'm Liz. Certified copies are used by organizations for lots of reasons. A certified copy is a substitute for an original document or identification card. When you need a certified copy of a document, the Justice of the Peace or Commissioner for Declarations is stating in their opinion that the document is genuine, true and complete copy. The first step is to check what is needed. Is there special wording needed? Some organizations have particular requirements. Does the copy need to be in color or is black and white okay? Do they need both the font and back of the ID card certified? How many copies do I need? The next step is to make the copies for certification. We might not have access to a printer or scanner. You can get copies at various places. You can also use an app like Adobe Scan to take a photo of the document which is converted to a PDF and can be printed. Make sure the copy is a good one with images and text clear and complete otherwise it might not be able to be certified. Leave enough room for us to add both our stamp and seal of office on the copy. Ideally about 10 cm by 3 cm is enough room both to fit the certification on the copy. It is not necessary that you personally have to get your certified copy, someone else can do it for you. It is really important though that the person getting the copy certified has the original with them. We cannot certify a copy as true if we can't see the original it is a copy of. A photo of your document or ID card cannot be considered the original for certification. You can have downloads and emails certified as well. Downloads can be certified copies, you still need a paper copy of the download and we will need to see the website where you got it from. Email attachments can be certified, but we will need to see the email and open the attachment. We hope that helps. You can locate a JP at many shopping centers, libraries and courthouses. You can also find a JP by visiting the QJO Find a JP service or through the after hours search on the Queensland government website. Goodbye for now.